Welcome to Tech Topics. Today's Tech Topic is Search Protector data sheets are so confusing. What do I really need to look for? You know, that is the honest truth. When you go to look at a, a data sheet for a search protector, there's a significant amount of information on there. Most of it is really just, you know, boilerplate mumbo-jumbo jargon, but a few of the important things you need to look for is obviously the voltage configuration. Also, you should be able to find on here what qualifications uh, or standards the, the product meets, sizes, weights, dims. But what we feel is one of the most important things to look at is the, the chart of measured limiting voltages or let-through voltages. This table here should tell you exactly how you expect this unit to perform in the field. One thing that you'll find missing from the majority, the vast majority of companies today is the, the let through voltage for the category A ring wave tests. These tests re represent switching transients. And that's the most important challenge that you're gonna have in your facility is dealing with those high speed millisecond events that cause disruption, confusion, software confusion. If your data sheet doesn't, rec doesn't, doesn't show these things, Get in touch with us. We're going to show you exactly what you expect this unit to do in the field. So, is information confusing? It can be. If you need some help sorting it out, let us know. 